Football team at Win Real Estate before the commencement of the auction. And those terms were agreeable by our vendors. You're more than comfortable to bid on that basis. Folks, number three are going close here in the beautiful suburb of Mulgrave. Here for the taking. Four bedrooms, a couple of bathrooms, multiple car spacing. Underpinning your prospective purchase of a nice even round number of 660 square metres of some of the most finest soil that Mulgrave has on offer. Throughout the property, bright, fresh, inviting, plenty of space and storage renovated throughout. Outdoor entertaining area, great land size, and of course appealing to each and every buyer in this record hot marketplace. The location, well, we know it is absolutely superb. We're a hop, skip and jump away from all of Mulgrave and its surrounding suburbs amenities, whether that be schools, public, private, secondary, primary, parks and reserves at your disposal, medical facilities, cafes, restaurants, and all the major freeway arterial road access that you could ask for as well, making this one of the most accessible suburbs in the southeastern corridor of Melbourne. And I've said this time and time again, by far, Mulgrave, and challenge me on this, and I'm sure the neighbours in the crowd will not, it is by far the most underrated suburb in the city of Monash, and undervalued if you ask me. Folks, right now we're in a marketplace that's unbelievable. We've got record low interest rates. We've got record low stock levels. And the property market right now is travelling at the fastest rate that it has within the last 20 years. So that means one thing as a potential buyer. You don't buy today, you spend more tomorrow. For a property you may not even like as much. This market does not reward the hesitant or pessimistic. It is absolutely in your best interest to show your strength and to be buying in this marketplace. Melbourne's population is going to exceed New South Wales within a couple of years. Have confidence. Population growth means real estate boom. It's not going to stop. So, without further ado, let's cut to the chase. You've seen the property. You've loved the property. Don't mind where we start the bidding. I've got an opening bidder offer in my mind where we'll get things underway, but I'd rather the bidders be the one to start us off. So, opening bidder offer, who wants to get things underway? At 900,000, Audrin, thank you very much. Coming in first place now, down the front, nice and clear here at $900,000 now. But number three, a boy in close here in the heart of Mulgrave. We're going to go in $20,000 rises, folks, to make it nice and easy for you and, of course, myself to follow here the bidding, of course. At 900,000 down the front, folks, right now, you've got an 80% chance of securing the property if you end up being the buyers here because when you're the opening bidder, you instantly flush out your competition. You show your strength from the get-go. So you've got that 80% chance right now. We're going to search for 20 grand to jump back right now as an absolute bare minimum. I've got a couple of vendor bids lined up up my sleeve. I'd rather not place them. I'd rather the market dictate what they want to pay for the property. But we do need a $20,000 rise as a minimum to jump back in over the top now. So number three, are going close here in the heart of Mulgrave. Bids down the front at 900000 Time to ignite the competition now, Audwin, or we may wrap things up. Once at 900000 Twice. At 900,000. Third. Final time. At 900,000. Just going to give the buyers every opportunity, Auburn. Can see there's a conversation happening there. Thank you for your patience. I really appreciate it. At $900,000 now, 20 grand to jump back. Auburn to jump back in. That's what we're going to search for now. 20 is a minimum. In or out? Auburn need to know. Just confirm with me. 20? Are we in or out? We're out? Having a conversation, that's fine, at $900,000 now. Folks, when your competition is not bidding, you should see there's an opportunity to get in quickly and show your strength. So, if there's any further bidding out in the crowd, now's the opportunity that you should see right now and jump in with open arms at $900,000. Now, Auburn, just confirm, there's no further bidding there. Needs to know 100% done. Out, finished and silent now. We're going to call it three times. Once, at 900, twice. Third and final opportunity, at 900000 20? 20? Not just yet, man. Really appreciate it. At $900,000 now, really appreciate the offer. Need the 20 to jump back. Potential competition there, folks, just so you know. But I am going to regretfully knock back the $10,000 increment. We do want to stay in 20s at this point in time. We're not even at the bottom of the advertised price range yet, just so we're clear. 20 to jump back. We're not even at the bottom of the advertised range, folks. Let's go. 20 on top. Let's not muck around. We'll have no hesitation passing the property in at $900,000 now. Auburn, I'll pass it in or place a vendor bid. What do you want me to do? Once, twice. I'm going to place a vendor bid, Auburn. I'll keep it gentle. Third, final time. 
20? Oh, but I'm going to place a vendor bid. Keep it 20? Let's go gentle. Just to tempt you back in, of course. I'm going to go 920 on my behalf, okay? On behalf of the vendors. That's a vendor bid of 920. Over to you to jump back now. Let's keep it in 20s. At $920,000 now. We can't muck around too much here. We want to speed things up along. At 920000 now. 40? 40 on top. Just confirming, Auburn. Can I confirm that at 40 on top? 940, good bid. Nice to see you again. At 940,000 now, bidding certainly underway now. At $940,000 now. Andre, let me know what's going on over there. At 940 now. At 940 is the current offer down the front. Bidding's been ignited now. At 60 to jump back in. At 940,000 now. Aldwin in or out. Once. At 940. G'day. Twice. At 940. Third. Final time. At 940,000. Alwyn, done in or out? Out? Sure. Sorry? 970. Bang, have a look at that. At nine, You were trying to get me down to 10 at the start of the auction, and you've just come in with a $30,000 increment. Cheeky. I would do exactly what we were doing, by the way. At 970,000. At 970 is the current offer. Nice to see you back into the auction. All the best. At $970,000 now. They're back in first place, folks. We're going to give you every opportunity to jump back in now. 970 is the offer. Do we say 20 to jump back and show some strength? At 970, let me know. Got to be in or out. In or out now. Need to know. Got to be quick or we're going to wrap it up. 970, I've got. Once. 80. Sure, we'll take the 10 now. That's okay. Dictate increments over to you at 10. 980 is the offer. Andre, 990 to jump back. All to be go aggressive at a million. At 980,000, coming in first place. Andre, let me know. Gentlemen's offer down the front at 980. Folks, in or out. 980 is the current offer. Gentlemen's bid down the front here. Can I say 10 to jump back in at 990? Or do we show some real strength and go straight to 1 mil? Andre, in or out. We're going to wrap it up once. At 980. Your bid, sir. Twice. At 9. 80. Third. One million. One million. Great bid. Great bid. At a million dollars now. Nice and even. At a million now. Time to jump back. Do we say a million in ten now? At a million in ten to jump back. Bid's over there. At a million dollars now, of course, against the BMW. Time to jump back. Ten on top. Need ten as a minimum. I knew you were going to offer me. That's why I said it. Because I knew you were going to offer me the five. Come on, Alvin. Ten on top. Not just yet the five. I do appreciate it. Ten on top. Five grand above that bid you were going to give me could be literally less than five dollars a week in interest repayments. Makes no sense to back away. Come on. At a million and ten. Bids with you at a million. Just bear with me. Thank you so much for your patience. At a million dollars now, ten to jump back in over the top. I'll give you every opportunity if they come back in. At a million dollars now, ten on top. Need to know. Folks confirming down the front. There's no further interest here. I'm going to assume they're out. It's between you and you. At a million now. Ten on top. Once. Twice. Ten. 10 on top, at a minute and 10. 20, need the 10. Andre, need the 10. Nothing less, happy to go more. At a minute and 10. For number three, a boy in close here, in the heart of Mulgrave. Beautiful four bedroom property renovated throughout with an abundance of natural light. Coming through the angle, making it so appealing to our family buyers in attendance here. At a minute and 10. Little ones have already picked out their bedroom. Don't worry about that. They told me. At a minute and 10. I saw the little one running up the house before. He really wants to buy. He's saying, come on, mum and dad, make sure you don't lose today. At a million and ten. Andre, 20? You sure you're done? 100% out? At a million and ten. We're going to wrap it up. We're going to go inside, Auburn. We'll have to take a very quick pause, okay? Once. At a million and ten. Andre. Twice. At a million and ten. We'll take a ten. Third. Final time. At a million and ten. Out. Have a chat amongst yourselves. We'll go inside. Have a chat amongst yourselves. There's five there. Okay, we'll take five first. Do you want to take it? Let's take the five. We'll take the five. We're we'll going to give five. you the same courtesy. At a million and fifteen. Five on top of twenty. At a million and fifteen. At a million and fifteen. Now coming in first place. Good strategy. Nice to chip back the auctioneer. Well done. That's how you buy at auctions. At a million and fifteen. Back in first place now. But we're going to wait and see if our family buyers are going to come back in here. Five grand to jump back now is what we're going to search for. Nothing less happen to go more though. At a million and fifteen. At a million and fifteen. At a million and fifteen. Twenty on top. Yes or no? In or out? Got to be quick. All we need to know. Once. At a million and fifteen. Twice. At a million and fifteen. Third. Final time. We're out. You sure? 
At a million and fifteen. Thank you again for your patience. Just waiting. At a million and fifteen. That's the offer. Five to jump back. Give it one more crack. We're very close. We're very close. Seventeen. Oh, my goodness. At a million and fifteen. Not just yet. I need the five. It's fair and reasonable. It's fair and reasonable, and I respect it. Unfortunately, I'm under strict instructions. Nothing less than five. Auburn. At a million and fifteen. Three grand above that bid is literally two dollars fifty a week extra in interest repayments. That's the cost of half a latte down the road. At a million and fifteen, give it one more crack. Out. Otherwise, we'll probably pass the property in, especially at this number. There'll be a salt sticker on the board in a few moments' time. You'll miss the opportunity. Your real estate journey will start all over again. Nobody likes open homes, but you'll have to do more of them. Nobody likes agents. Nobody likes auctioneers. You'll have to start that journey all over again. And Auburn's going to call you Monday through to Sunday, trying to... Okay, we got there, sure. At a million and 20. At a million and 20. We're back in. You sure you're out now? Okay, no problem. At a million and 20. Folks, we're going to give you a moment to chat amongst yourselves. Current bids at a million and 20. Thank you for your patience. We'll be right back. Thank you. Folks, I want to thank you so much for your patience and anticipation just while we consulted there with our owners. I have got some incredible news, okay? And I'm going to look at our underbidders and our current highest bidders. We're on the market. We're selling the property. There's no post negotiations. There's no vendor bidding. We're going to be knocking it down. Should there be no further bidding? Sir, I just want to tell you right now, when this happens, there could be more bids coming. So just be prepared for that. Otherwise, we're going to be knocking it down at a million and twenty now. Make no mistake about that. At a million and twenty. Aldwin, need to know, are we selling or not? Once. At a million and twenty. 
twice. 25 on top. At a minute and 25. Had a feeling it was going to happen, sir. I did preempt it. At a minute and 25. That's one minute and a quarter. Sir, are we sure? Now, ma'am, just bear with me because when we're on the market, I can and I probably should take small increments. I'll do the same for you if they jump back. I've just got to suggest that you do the right thing eth ethically, okay? At a minute and 25. Ray, hang on a sec. Would you come in for a thousand? I've got to ask the question. If I didn't ask the question, it would be wrong of me as an auctioneer. Would you come in for a thousand? At a minute and 25 is the offer. 26 to jump back, 1,000. Otherwise, I'm knocking it down. If you say no to the thousand, I know then you're out. At a minute and 25, let me know. Last opportunity, once. At a minute and 25, twice. At a minute and 25, third. Final time. At a million and 25, we're selling. We're selling. Out. Folks, are we out or in? At a minute and 25. Thanks for the patience. Incredibly resilient. Really appreciate it. Just need to know. At a minute and 25. Confirm with me, please. In or out? At a minute and 25 is the offer. Folks, in or out? It's all right. Give me whatever you want. At a minute and 25. Need to know. We out? Out? You sure? Now, I don't usually ask this. Andre, Andre, I don't usually ask this because I don't need your permission, obviously. I need the agent's and vendor's permission, but do I have your permission to knock it down? I genuinely have never asked that in my career to a buyer. Do I have your permission? Because I want to be sincere with you. I want to be sincere with you. I respect your family situation at the moment. You're looking to buy a beautiful property. Do I have your permission to knock it down? Okay, at a million and 25, all of them were selling. Once, twice, third, final time, we're selling, selling. All when you're scaring me. By the way, any other auctioneer would have probably knocked it down by now. In or out? Auburn, I need to know. At a million and 25, Andre, Andre. Oh, can you just commend the patience here? Yeah, I really appreciate it. I'm just, I'm so sorry. I'm just waiting. So sorry. Really commend your patience. Thank you so much. I would do the absolute same for you if I was selling your property. You know that. There's no rush to an auction, okay? Just trying to do the right thing by the buyers. And the agent will absolutely crack it at me if I knock this down and there's more there. Aldwin, in or out? Once. Come on, Aldwin. I'm calling it three times. One last time. Twice. Third opportunity, Ordway. Okay, we're selling. We're selling. We're sold. Congratulations. Well bought. Well done. Thank you so much to our bidders, our underbidders.